What is going down? I am Sammy Goldberg. Welcome to Mr. Bar Exam on AboveTheLaw.com. And we have gone through a ton of subjects so far. We've done property, we've done contracts, we've done criminal law, we've done criminal procedure, we've done securities, we've done corporations, and we have done New York CPLR. Let me tell you something. New York CPLR is a tricky subject. There's a lot of stuff to memorize, and it can make you want to shoot yourself in the head. Luckily for us and everybody watching this video, we have Professor Vincent Alexander who teaches at St. John's University. But let me tell you something, he's got a fun, entertaining way for you to learn the CPLR and I guarantee you it's going to stick in your head. And later on, we are going to speak with him and see what his idea is. So right now, the topic of the day is this, the dumber the better. In my personal opinion, I believe that the people who go to the dumber school have an easier time studying for the bar exam. And the reason being is this. The dumber schools don't care about theory. They don't care about any of that junk. All they care about is you passing the bar exam. So all they really teach you is everything that's going to be on the bar because they want their school to be right. Their hopes and dreams are, please, can we be right this year? Please, can we get a ranking? I want to be on a ranking. So what they want to do is they want you to pass the bar at any expense possible. So they purposely teach you to pass the bar. Every subject is designed for the bar exam and it's designed for you to know it when you go into your bar prep course. So the kids that went to these dumber law schools are the ones that I think have an edge. They've got an advantage. They're probably the ones that are having the easier times because they've learned it all, they've seen it all, and I, I commend them to be honest. I do commend them. So right now, why don't we go to Professor Alexander that is going to show you the way to learn the CPLR. Well, let me tell you the story of Commits his client suit in tort. He knew the CPLR. I said the CPLR it is the code we all live for. If you know procedure, every firm will need you and you'll practice forevermore. Now the lawyer went looking for defendants dwelling where the summons he could leave and mail. But after diligence and effort, he resorted to half fixing so his service it would not fail. He knew the CPLR. I said the CPLR. Jurisdiction, there is none, said she. But the long arm statue grabs a joint toward phaser, who's a non domiciliary. He knew the CPLR, I said the CPLR, it is the code we all live for. Sing out if you know procedure, every firm will need you, and you'll practice forevermore. But defendant who was clever raised the bar of limitations for this tort was much too old. But plaintiff's lawyer wasn't worried, cause his client was an and the statute it had been told. He knew the CPLR, I said the CPLR, it is the code we all live for. If you know procedure, every firm will need you and you'll practice forevermore. Now you students of Barbary, you should take a lesson from this tale about the CPLR. Learn your pleadings and your motions and your jurisdiction and you're sure to pass the news. should be studying for the bar.